Patrick McIntosh from Smallfield near Gatwick is a pretty active kind of guy, it's safe to say. He's climbed Mount Kilimanjaro, he's sailed across the Atlantic, he's even trekked to the South Pole. And incredibly, he's done all those things after surviving cancer, not just once, but three times. Yeah. Now the 62-year-old is about to undertake a truly extraordinary challenge to cycle all the way to Japan. He's setting off from Twickenham Stadium in May aiming to arrive in Tokyo in September, just in time for the Rugby World Cup. And he's hoping to raise thousands for cancer charity along the way. Juliet Parkin has been to meet him. He describes himself as a mad cyclist who's going to cycle around the world. And after surviving three types of cancer, it may sound a little crazy, but that's exactly what Patrick McIntosh intends to do. I have survived three cancers primarily as a consequence of having the good fortune to have been diagnosed very early and so therefore I felt that having survived these extraordinary events I should give something back. Rugby fan Patrick will leave Twickenham Stadium in May and hopes to arrive in Tokyo in September just in time for the Rugby World Cup. En route he'll clock up over 7,000 miles across Europe and Russia raising money for both the World Cancer Research Fund and for St Catherine's Hospice in Crawley. We get less than a third of our funding from the NHS and we are hugely reliant on the generosity of people like Patrick and supporters from our local community to raise the funds that, that we need to keep going. Supporting Patrick all the way in a camper van will be his friend Glenn. My wife died 25 years ago from cancer when I had two small children aged five and seven. And since then I've done various things for charity. Patrick said, at one St Catherine's do that he would like to do this trip and he needs somebody to help him. So it was a perfect thing for me to do. For one more day of hard skiing to go. Patrick McIntosh is used to big challenges. He reached the South Pole in 2015. And what does he plan to do after reaching Japan? Take a rest before cycling all the way home, of course. Juliet Park in BBC South East Today, Crawley. What a thing to do. Amazing. amazing. Now, in this weekend's football, all our league teams are in action. Brighton and Hove Albion take on Burnley at the Amex for a evening.